Yo, what's going on guys? Shake and Bake back and look at this! NBA Live has finally released the screenshots and they didn't give us just one. They gave us like six really HD close-ups, face views, facial scans, I guess that's what we're gonna call it. And man, Blake Griffin is the one I think that looks the best. The freckles, the details of his hair looks unreal. This is such a massive step up from last year's NBA Live 14 where there wasn't face scans and they built the graphics from scratch. This is so much better. You're gonna see a trailer at the end of this video on how this was all done, how they all put it together, how they did the facial scans with the rigs and everything. It looks awesome. I love the trailer. It's nice. And man, look at these graphics. You can see they were all taken in Oklahoma City. And you can even see the blue uh, shirts in the background. So it's a playoff atmosphere, which is kind of nice. But man, the sweat on the players looks realistic. They don't look like plastic. They don't look shiny. They look great. You can see the body mold of Paul George up here. His upper body looks like him. This, like Rondo as well, that actually looks like Rondo. That's how Rondo actually looks. He doesn't have massive upper body like Paul George kind of has and I like the way they've got this it's looking really great so far and this is a great start to NBA Live 15 I can't wait to see some more details some more graphics to hear some more about the ultimate team because these players right now look amazing they've also been using the uh, rig that they use to scan players for jerseys and stuff like that which they will show you I, I, I really couldn't be more excited for this man this was way more than I thought we were gonna get I thought we were gonna get just one small little screenshot with the six player faces. No, they hit us with close ups of all the players. They gave us a freaking little trailer behind the scenes. It's awesome, it's amazing. Steph Curry, that one is kind of a blurry, I think. I don't know, but it doesn't look the best, but the other ones look way better. But here's the trailer. Hope you enjoy. Woo! We made some choices last cycle that ended up not being the right choices. And the unfortunate reality of it was, you know, it fell short of where we really wanted it to be. So in 15, we reinvested, we doubled down. We built a custom scanning rig with uh, an array of 12 DSLR cameras. We kind of defined what our needs were in terms of the scanner it had to be easy to use, had to be portable, because in the past it's just been way too cost prohibitive for us to actually create the volume of high quality assets. And so because of the old way we used to work, that's why a lot of our likenesses would fall short with NBA Live 14. In order for an artist to go ahead and use any available photo reference that we have, it would take them approximately six days to create a likeness. Now we get an automated result in 45 minutes. It's really cut our time spend down, but at the same time exponentially increased our quality. As we started seeing the results coming out of those scans, we started to quickly realize, wow, that stuff's looking good. How many things can we actually get in front of this scanner? I mean, we started scanning uniforms and uh, to be able to pull wrinkles and stitching and other details out of I couldn't be happier with, with the, the look of the game than it is right now. And the best part about it is, is we still have some time to go, and I know we're gonna get even better than what we've got.